When the latest eruption of the Sunuka crater chain in the Swartzengi volcanic system of the Reykjanes Peninsula in Iceland started, it quickly reached the vicinity of the town of the Grindavik, but it was halted and stopped by the defensive wall we had around them, especially L12 and L13 were very effective in that. The movement of the lava was blocked, but some of it lately, some of the lava, a tongue of lava, breached toward the east. And I mapped it and I reported it. And uh, you can see the map now any moment here. And uh, that was how it was. This is the map of the lava, the latest eruption, as you can see. And this is the movement of it. Lately, we have the tremors chart showing that the lava is flowing freely. There is nothing blocking it. We can see it in the GPS data. Entry of the lava toward the Schwarzenegger volcanic system and exit of it are equal. That means the lava is adding probably to the existing K1 crater. And now today, we had a huge amount of the gas rising from the volcano with the amount of the increase in eruption and then a breach of the wall. This is the L12 defensive wall being breached by the a tongue of lava. For the first time, a tongue of lava is moving westward toward the Grindavik. And we are seeing that because it's a Saturday, it's a little bit of a late reaction, but the investigation team is coming. You can see the cars of them moving here to this area, and they're trying to assess the situation. It's a small at the moment. It may solidify, but it may also increase and just, you know, add to the amount of the uh, lava actually breaching this uh, wall. We have to wait and see. This is a fast situation developing, and uh, it seems that... Uh, the lava is going to extend and it may uh, go toward the eastern side of the Grindavik if it is not solidified or stopped by building the or extending the wall that is the L12 defensive wall.